be water, my friend. Quarantine. A time of struggle for some, and meanwhile for others, it's time to play and catch up on your favorite anime shows and manga. And that includes on Netflix, you know, the Netflix originals and that backlog you have stacked up like I do, like up this tall, of everything from light novels to manga to just regular books, everything. In my case, it, w it was pretty much that, not the Netflix and the anime stuff. True, I do have a log of anime, but that was my more important thing because for me, I end up having stacks up to this tall and never get into it until I get in the mood. But quarantine has been a lot of, giving me a lot of time to sit down and, you know, just, you know, read. And, you know, when I went and ran out of the manga, I went on a buying spree and spent a bunch of money at a local store, which, I mean, you need to shop local, especially right now with everything that's going on. But that is when I found this gem that you are here for. Uh, it's also, if you somehow can't read, and I'm just speaking to you, it's called Saki the Succubus Hungers Tonight. So let's just hop right into it. It's all about Saki-chan, who is this beautiful young woman and just a little naive. She may seem harmless at first uh, as she wanders the streets, but you must beware she is a brand new succubus who thrives on the lust of men, just as all succubus does. And just keep in mind, she's not very good at it. When she finds herself with an opportunity to move in with a 30-year-old, some 30-something-year-old man, 35, I think, uh, who has never slept with a woman, she takes it just like she'll take him. I pretty much just give you a synopsis on what was in the back. So let me give you a little bit of background on this uh, this manga is full of non-stop, unadulterated sexual tension that will make you want more and more as you keep going and going and going. So let's just jump into the actual manga itself, why don't we? The story follows our two main characters, Saki, who's the age of 20, the succubus, and their 35-year-old virgin, Oda Renta, uh, who is an office worker by day. These two meet under unusual circumstances uh, while shopping for porno mags at a local convenience store. Uh, Oda, that's when he ran into this girl who trips and smashes her boobs. Am I reading that right? Trips and smashes her boobs into the window. Yes, I did read that right. Um, she was attracted basically to his horniness that he was giving off, aka the dick that has a mind of its own. You know, guys know how it is, and if you guys don't, just go ask your boyfriend if you, if you ladies don't know. Being startled, she ran away and leaving Rentuck very confused at this random convenience store. So he said, it's probably, probably just daydream, so he ran off, or more of, he headed home to find this same person, Saki, passed out in front of his apartment and keep in mind that like this whole time he was walking home at the store so on and so forth he had a stiffy just keep it in mind so like any sane hentai protagonist he picked her up and took her into the apartment and to where his hormones continued to rage and he let her you know take a shower and at that point, he, like, takes a peek and sees everything that she brings to the party. Then, you know, they try to sleep, and he sleeps on the bed, and she sleeps on the floor, because she offered, and, you know, trying to be nice and stuff, and, well, um, he realized that he needs to get rid of the stiffy, and there's only one way to do that, and he can't do it because she's there. So, he falls asleep, and then the next thing you know, Saki's clinging onto him, like, she crawled up in the bed and then she grabbed onto his arm and then fell asleep so what does any sane man do apparently he jacks it off right there and then and then some of the energy aka the seeds uh got onto her and she absorbed it and that stopped her sexiness hormones from getting out and causing every man around her to be super horny and be attracted to her and you might be wondering why is that happening why do succubus give out that hormone well it's because like i said they need men's man's seed to calm the hormones which is why they have sex with a lot of partners non-stop and 
the thing with Saki is she wants to find her first love to, you know, have sex with before she, you know, does all that. So basically the whole manga follows that and goes on with a bunch of sexual tension. And I hope you've been enjoying the pictures. Whatever pictures I find, I don't know. I'm recording this before I find the pictures. I hope you guys enjoyed the pictures that have popped up. But there's a huge amount of sexual tension throughout it. And throughout the rest of the book, you meet her sister where she sits down and explains everything. He, she gets like, okay, I'm going to give you a card so you can just pay for all the expenses that she's going to cost, which, you know, food, clothing, all that stuff. So you go through like a whole thing where she's trying out different clothes, super sexy outfits, all different kinds of stuff. Basically fan service galore. So I picked up the second volume and I'll let you guys know on my Twitter how the second volume is. But for right now, that is my review. Well, that's my overview of Saki the Succubus. My personal opinion, I find it funny. Um, I was reading it at work with a bunch of other guys that are into manga and all that stuff. And they couldn't stop laughing at it because there's actually pretty decent comedy. Because it's straight up like sexual tension, which nowadays there's not a lot of manga besides straight up porn to have that which is nice because it's a change of pace plus it's all adults it's not just high school it's not high schoolers thank god it's straight up adults so that's even more rare throughout manga nowadays which i hope we can get more like older people manga i guess like you know adults and like based like like you know it would be nice to have like a college like manga like based on college i know kaon did a thing about it but i don't know if it was made into a manga i think it was but i'm talking about like an actual series not just a little spin-off or something but that's just me i hope you guys enjoy my uh, little thing here and there uh make sure you check out my twitch my discord all that stuff and i will catch you guys later